Okay, here's the big guy, you guys. This Jellycat Fergus the Frog. He's medium size. He is rare, it says. And let's see what he sold for. Hey, Bella Buddies, thanks for watching. Amazing, right? All right, let's get started. Hey, Bella Buddies, thanks for watching. All right, you guys, in this video, we are going to talk about my favorite plush to find. Not because it's like the biggest money bolo. However, wait until you see what some of these sold for. Absolutely crazy. I didn't even know that they sold for this much. So, this is a category video, and the category is going to be Jelly Cat plush. And I just love finding these. I always pick them up if I see them. And I think they're fresh on my mind because lately I've been running into them a lot at garage sales. And I typically pick these up for 50 cents to a dollar. So the return is great, even if they're just bread and butter. So we are going to get started here. The first one I'm going to show you is one of mine and it's just so cute. But then we're going to go into the big money ones that you need to be looking for. Absolutely crazy. All right. So the first item, I sold this little fella. It is a jelly cat carrot. And I got this at the Goodwill bins. It was a bins find. And it's not very big. Let me see. Right here is the tape measure next to it. Nine inches. But it's just, it's small. And just super, super cute. And I was thrilled to find it. Whenever I see this little right here, this jelly cat London, I am grabbing it and taking it to go. Um, all right. So let's go on to some of the big money ones. I did accept a best offer of $20 plus shipping on that. All right. So let's start with this guy right here. Now, typically, it seems like the bears don't go for as much money. So I wanted to point this one out to you guys. Like Build-A-Bear, the standard bears are not the ones going for big money. The ones that are going for big money are the specialty bears um like that don't look like bears like the themes i have a video on the top 10 build a bear to be on the lookout for but also let me take you over here to the rebel resellers channel and she did a more recent video than mine um but anyway definitely go check that video out one of the items sold for seventeen hundred dollars so there are definitely Build-A-Bear out there that are big money. But what I wanted to tell you is Rebel is going to be doing a whole series on different plush brands, kind of like I'm doing this Jelly Cat. She's going to pick a plush category and teach you guys about it. And she is a bolo finder, but she specializes in plush. So please go sub up her channel. All right, let's go back to, I'll link it down below. Let's go back to this bear. Huge Barth. Tholomew, that's such a hard word to say, Bear, Jelly Cat London Plush. This guy sold for $90 plus shipping, and he's got his original tag up in his ear, so I'm sure that helped. And if you look right here at the next one, Jelly Cat Bashful Bunny. It seems like these bashful bunnies do really, really well. So if you see a Jelly Cat Bunny, grab it. Um, I'm not sure. I really just continued to see them in the high solds. I wasn't really looking at low solds. So I'm sure there's some bread and butter bunnies also, but I did see a lot of high dollar ones. This one sold for $75 plus shipping and shipping is $16.50. I have no idea why the shipping was so high on that. The next item that sold is another one. This one is Bashful Dot Bunny. And you can see right here, the little ears have the polka dots on them. Super, super cute. And the standard jelly cat tag. That's what you're looking for. And they do stand out because they are just really well-made plush. $99.99 plus shipping. This guy right here is a rare jelly cat blossom. Delilah Aqua Blue Pony Horse Retired. And it is super cute. It's got these floral feet. And again, this one is new with the original tags. This one sold on auction for $84 plus shipping. And I did verify all of these with feedback. 
The next item here is this Jelly Cat Squid, which I just think is absolutely amazing. It is new with tags. I don't know if the pre-owned go for as much. Um, I think I have a screen I'm going to pull up here that we can kind of look at that. But uh, let's see. Let's go in here because you can see that it is slashed through. So that means that a best offer was accepted. So actually, I learned this little tip from the Rebel reseller. If you go into Terapeak and you put into the search right here, Jelly Cat Squid, and then you scroll down and I filtered from average sold price. And this one right here is a lot of, um, it's a multi-listing. Multi Somebody must have went into their store and wanted to order a bunch and then they just used one photo here. But you can look. And right here it is. It looks like they took a best offer of $85. So this one was brand new. Here is one that does not have the tags that sold for $60. Here's one that sold for $56.95. And again, I am in Terapeak. So that's going to tell me the best offer price for this item. So you kind of have to line up the title and the photo to, to figure out which one it is. That's how I did it. I don't know if there's an easier way. If anybody knows an easier way, please let me know. But I just wanted to scroll down and I filtered high to low. So you can see some of them sold in the $20 range, but they probably just priced it too low. They probably could have gotten more. So that's one way to check best offer. And again, shout out to the Rebel reseller for teaching me that in her Build-A-Bear video. All right, the next item here is this Jelly Cat Colin Laying Down Rare Tie-Dye Plush Lizard. 20 inch and retired and he sold for $90 plus shipping. It's just amazing that stuffed animals can sell for that much money. And if you look here, I am on Terra Peak and I want to show you guys that again, um, the prices high to low, $74.99, $65, $49.95. Actually, I don't know what that one is. That's a vulture. I don't know why that one came up. Maybe Maybe it's a, a bundle also. But if you look down here, these are only 12 inch. So there is a smaller version, which still brings a decent amount in the $30 range. So that's another one to be on the lookout for as well. All right. This one is super cute. It's a Jelly Cat Lilac Oney Bunny Stuffed Rabbit Easter Bunny Purple. So anytime I have a bunny, I typically put Easter in the title if I have room because around or before Easter, people are going to be looking for things for Easter baskets. Um, this one sold for $92.99 plus shipping. The next item is another bashful bluebell bunny, medium plush, 12 inches, and it is retired. And they use the word lovey in the title. Typically, I use the word lovey if it's like a blanket, but um, I guess you could use it for a stuffed animal. This one sold for $87.95 plus shipping, or free shipping on that. The next item is so cute. I love this little fuzzy fur. I think that is so cute. I mean, probably not something I would expect to see on a reindeer, maybe like an owl or something, but super cute nonetheless. And this is Large Robin the Reindeer, 26 inches this one is. And let's go in here and see what the best offer. Oh, first off, if you go into the feedback, I was going to show you guys this. This is how I typically confirm that an item has been paid for and received. If you go into the seller's feedback, put in Jelly Cat, you can see right here that it was a good sale and they got feedback. Again, I have checked all of these that I'm showing you. I don't always check them all, but I did for these. It seems like people like to leave feedback for plush. A lot of times like on collectibles and harder to find items, a lot of times people don't leave feedback. So it's hard to verify that way. But with plush, it was pretty easy. Okay, so... We are now in to Terra Peak and it sold for $62.50. So they listed it at $100 and took a best offer of $62.50. So when you're searching solds, it's a good idea to go in and see what that best offer was because that's a pretty big difference, $62 to $100. Yes, it's still a big money bolo, in my opinion, $62 for a plush. I'll take it any day, um, but it's not $100. All right, here. And look at these. There's three of them here for 50 bucks. So just definitely a, a cool item. But again, you know, they're going to range. But don't be afraid to price your item high. And 
you may not be the quickest sale. You may have to sit on it a little bit. I guess it just depends on what your business plan is. Are you looking to sell things quickly or are you looking to make more money for your items? I love this guy. Jelly Cat Truffle Red Elephant Large Stuffed Animal Pillow Plush New with Tags. $100, four bids on that one. And you can see right here in the feedback, sold for 100 bucks, and feedback was left. The next item is this Jelly Cat Bow Bigfoot plush, and he is new with tags. He is super cute, and there was a best offer on this one. So what I did is I went in and I looked for that tile in the background, and it looks like they took a best offer of $90 on this one. And you can see here, 78, 75, so 70, quite a few in the $70 range. So definitely look for Bigfoot. And we're coming up on one that is just completely going to shock you guys. So make sure you stay tuned for that. It's just, I can't even believe it. Uh, Jellycat Jamie Bunny. So here is another bashful bunny. This one sold for $124.99 with free shipping. The next item is another one. This is Gigi Bashful Bunny. It's a rare retired, new without tags, sold for $125. Um, I, I would probably put pre-owned if it didn't have tags personally, um, but it looks like new without tags condition never played with. So maybe it was a personal item and they just sat it on a shelf. But to me personally, to keep myself from getting an item not as described, I would probably put pre-owned for that. Oh, wait here. It looks like they did put used. They put used in the condition, but this NWOT means new without tags. Okay, let's look at the next one here. This one really is a fun one. Jelly Cat Amusable Coffee to Go Bag. So I, I don't know if it like holds your coffee. I don't know what this thing is, but it's super, super cute. And these sell pretty well. So if you see them, definitely uh, look them up because they sold four of these for $69 plus shipping. The next item is a lot of three. So if you get three or four or five and, you know, they're in the 20 or less range, you could put them in a lot. That would be completely up to you. Um, this one is a Jelly Cat Fuzzy Bunny Forest Forager Nook and Little Eddie Elephant. And this sold for $90 plus shipping. The next item here is this awesome Jelly Cat Rose Dragon. It seems like dragons always do really, really good. Um, super cool item with the original tag. $139.99 on that. And it looks like it has a little dust bag. How cool is that? All right, here's another bunny. This one's a little different. This one says Super Rare Jelly Cat Bunny Rabbit Plush Bead Eyes Oatmeal Color. And this is a hard to find bunny that has bead eyes, not the common sewn eyes. And it ha and she is in good, clean something. All right. And you can see here that they took a best offer of $99.99 with free shipping on that one. The next item is another dragon, and they have sold two of these. It says $230 plus shipping. If you click on two sold, you can go in here and it's going to give you more details. It looks like one sold for $230, and then maybe they accepted an offer on another one. And that's the buyer history there. So, um, and if you look right here, the buyer did pay for the one where they accepted an offer. And the offer accepted was $197.50, $197.50 there. And this dragon, you can just see $95, $155. And this one has a small, a small, medium, and a large for $155. Wow. Uh, $207. Oh, looks like somebody messed up here. They only sold it for $20. Ah, definitely do your research, you guys. Uh, this one sold for $300, but it's 35 inches. So he's a big guy. So yeah, lots of uh, lots of high solds on this one. And this was a small one. They sold it for $6.50. It looks like on auction. Eek, not good. Okay. The next item here that sold is another dragon. This is the Sage Green, and it is so pretty. Sold for 
The next item that sold is another dragon. This is the snow dragon and it sold for $335. So as you can see, as the bigger they are, the more they go for. Um, but all of these are just doing really, really well. I know I want to go find one of these at a garage sale. Um, this one here, feedback was left 335. Another bashful bunny. This one is Nikki Bunny Blue. Rare and retired. $175 on that one. Okay, here's the big guy, you guys. This jelly cat Fergus the Frog. He's medium size. He is rare, it says. And let's see what he sold for. It says 800 Best offer accepted. So feedback was left. Highly recommend an absolute pressure to work with. Item shipped very quickly. It was in perfect condition, just like the description. We communicated frequently. Very friendly and personable. Hope to do business again. Thank you so much. I bet they hope to do business again as the seller. <laughs> All right, let's see. Um, it looks like, let me see the picture here. Yep. It's this one right here. So they took a best offer of $750. There's one for $860, $805, So a lot of times people will say, oh, it's money laundering um, for big money plush. But right here, these are not all money laundering with all different resellers or, or sellers. I guess I don't know if they're all resellers. Maybe it's a personal item from their house. But uh, yeah, this frog is money, money, money. So be on the lookout. The next item is another bashful bunny. Here's another Gigi sold for $125 free shipping. Come on. <laughs> this is a Jelly Cat London bashful platypus. Um, new without tags, rare and retired, sold for $75. We have this guy that is Jelly Cat Sasha snow tiger 18 inches crate barrel so it must have been um like an exclusive possibly for crate and barrel i feel like the seller should have maybe turned the thing so we could see its face I, i'm not really sure what's going on here um definitely recommend pictures more pictures uh 79.99 plus shipping it's still sold so <laughs> all right here is another set of the fuzzles and this is a fox, puppy, kitten, and bunny. Sold for $130, free shipping. Okay, this is Jelly Cat Gilbert the Gator. And again, two photos, very short and sweet uh, title. And it's still sold for $60 bucks plus shipping. This item here is a Jelly Cat Nocturnal Owl. Super cute. That might be the same seller. This one sold for 50 bucks plus shipping. And again, the shipping is just high. Um, these should be able to ship first class. What I typically do, this is how I ship plush. Um, I take bubble wrap and I wrap it around their eyes. And then I put it in a bubble wrap poly mailer. Um, I know the Rebel reseller is going to have some tips and tricks um, over on her channel where she's doing... Um, ship with me videos to teach you guys how she packages and ships her plush. So you can check that out as well. All right. The next item is this jelly cat dozy do frog sold for $50 plus shipping. Again, first class on these. Um, you know, I wonder if the seller is putting priority mail on these items because they want the insurance. Here is what I do with first class. Um, I ship the item first class if it's 16 ounces or less. And then I use pirate ship to add insurance. And I have a whole video that shows you how to do that. But it's really, really easy. And if you ship the item first class, you can add insurance. I think it's for $75 or less. It's like 75 cents. It may be a little bit higher right now because um, shipping prices have gone up. But if you check out that video, I show you how to do it. It's also great for priority mail if you have to add insurance to a package. So let's say you have a $500 item and you um, are insured for $100. You want to insure that item for $500. Pirate Ships Insurance is way cheaper than eBay's. So be sure to check out that video that I did. I'll try to remember to link it down below. The next item is this Jelly Cat Large Henry the Hound. He sold for $65 plus shipping. 
And then we have this little Jelly Cat Nocturnal Bat. I just listed a bat. Mine is a slightly different color, but this one sold for $40 plus shipping. The next item is this Jelly Cat White Smudge Bunny. And you can see these are all from the same seller. And it looks like this one, is this? No, this is a different seller. No, it's got that gray background. But this one, the shipping's lower. So let me see, was this Oregon also? Yeah, hmm. So maybe they, I don't know why that one's 1610 in this one. They actually fixed it on this one. So maybe they're doing sell similar. I'm not sure, but I hope they update that because they'll probably sell more if they can get that, get that shipping price down. 40 bucks on this guy. So what I did is I found one of their sold listings. And when I was checking to see if uh, they had feedback for the item, I saw when I typed in Jelly Cat, I saw a whole bunch of solds. So I wanted to show you guys some of these that are in the $40 and $50 range that may be a little bit easier to find. This little guy is a Jelly Cat Amusable Mushroom sold for $90 plus shipping. So these all had feedback. Jelly Cat Wowzer Dog French Bulldog, $65, free shipping on him. And the next item is this worm. You guys, look at this. It's a worm. It's so cute. And it's kind of got that like corduroy look to it. It says, uh, Jelly Cat Waldo Worm Soft Toy Plush Cordy Pink Garden Life. New with original tag, $69.99 uh, free shipping. The next item is this uh, Small Cali Cow Plush. He is only seven inches and he's selling for $47.95. It looks like they sold two of them. Let's go in and see if they actually sold them. Yep, they both sold for $47.95. And the next item, I love this one. The Jelly Cat London Daisy Runner Duck Goose Small Regular Morgan Mallard. So there's three of them here and they went for 150 bucks. Such a cute set. The next item is this Jelly Cat Sloth. He sold for $65 plus shipping. And then we have the Werewolf. Uh, Wilf, Wilf, Wolf. And it is a Werewolf plush. And if you check out the Build-A-Bear video, either mine or the Rebel Resellers, or both, you will see a Build-A-Bear werewolf that is also a bolo. This guy sold for $66 plus shipping. And the next item is this Onyx Dragon Jelly Cat. So very, very cool. It looks like it's a smaller one there. All right, you guys, again, please go check out the Rebel Reseller. She is fantastic. Uh, love her channel, love what she's doing for the community, educating me on plush. I know that for sure. I am really, really enjoying selling plush. But Jelly Cat is, I'm going to say my favorite, uh, my favorite plush to find. All right, you guys, there's going to be some videos popping up here and here and a subscribe and a video down below. If you would like to subscribe to the channel, I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you so much for being here and watching. Let me know in the comments, what was your favorite um, your favorite plush in this video. It doesn't have to be the most expensive. Like, which one did you think was the cutest? Like, I love my little carrot, but that worm, oh my goodness, I love the worm. All right, you guys, thanks for watching.